We are learning some new details this afternoon about a heroic rescue on a San Diego freeway. We first brought you this story yesterday. A driver who got trapped in his burning car after a crash. Our Jason Sloss spoke to the FedEx driver who pulled the man out and joins us live from Miramar with much more on this. Jason. Hey, Maria, Andrew. Well, just some incredible heroics playing out on the 15 here in Miramar. It happened yesterday morning around 3 o'clock. A FedEx driver was making his way from Riverside County to Otay Mesa. I just saw what looked like somebody potentially needing serious help, and I just thought, you know, I'm, I'm the first one there, so I've got to be the first one to try to help him. Well, Jonathan Rohrbeck right there spotted a car that had crashed in the Miramar area near Highway 52. Part of the car was on fire. He says he didn't see anyone outside the car, decided to quickly stop, grabbed his phone and a fire extinguisher from his FedEx truck. He temporarily knocked down the fire, noticed the driver was trapped after the guardrail had gone through the driver's door. Rohrbeck said the driver was yelling about his legs. He couldn't use them. He was trapped. So Rohrbeck managed to pull the driver out and safely away from the car, which quickly went up in flames. All of this in a matter of minutes, Rohrbeck made the 911 call and stayed with the injured driver until emergency crews arrived and got him to the hospital. Looking at it, even without the fire, just looking at the way that guardrail went through there, I'm, he's lucky he got out with what, you know, the little bit that he did for the injuries that he did. There he keeps calling me a hero and telling me I saved his life. And, but I just did what I think anybody would do, or, you know, it, at least I did the best that I could with what I had there. So that's, that's all I can chalk that up to. Now, I imagine most would call him a hero. As for the driver, 28-year-old San Diego man, he's expected to recover. Uh, CHP says DUA, DUI was not a factor in the crash. Now, Rohrbach said after the rescue, he continued on to Otay Mesa and finished his shift. He's a Lake Elsinore resident and said uh, he kind of uh, went back and used some of the training he got as a volunteer firefighter years ago in Ohio. Live in Miramar, Jason Sloss, Fox 5 News. Only certain kinds of people do that, stop and do that, and then continue Fortunately, on. Fortunately, in the right place at the right day. time, too. That's right. Jason, thank you. All right, Jason, thank you.